Hey there, these are reviews from Mob.org, and now we're going to shake it a little. Let's start with the top game as usual. Today's top game list is dedicated to 3D runners. We'll have a review of 2D runners some other time. Blades of Brim is an awesome fantasy runner definitely worthy of being at the top. Incredible constantly changing locations, fairy tale graphics, wonderful music, and many game options. Jump, run on the walls, travel through portals, ride pets, and fight against enemies and bosses as you go. Unlock new weapons, heroes, and pets, level up your abilities, and fight for the title of the best hero of Blades of Brim. Victoria took all the best parts of Subway Surfers and increased that in its creation called Vlad's Vampire Dash. You'll experience an exciting journey across Transylvania. A young vampire was born not like the others. He is much more interested in chocolate, sweets, ice cream, and cherry syrup than in blood. You will go out every night looking for candies and return to your coffin before sunrise. Each dash is held on a new level with new locations, decorations, and obstacles. Into the Dead is for those who like gloomier adventures. Its gameplay differs from that of regular runners. You will not find three obstacle lines, bright cartoon characters, or merry music here. You are surrounded by real zombies, so to run means to survive, but it's not about having fun. So run and dodge the walking dead while killing their population with everything you can find on the way. Before each round, you can choose a bonus, but it won't help you for too long as the task will get harder because of weather conditions and the growing number of enemies. Uh, that guy is running the wrong way, don't you think? Sonic Dash is the brightest and the most dynamic runner for today. Who can match the fastest hedgehog in the world? Play as Tails, Knuckles, and other friends of Sonic. You are going to compete with two of the biggest enemies of Sonic, the insidious Eggman and the deadly dangerous Zaz from Lost World. Dodge rockets, take enemies off the road, and be first on the leaderboard. Do this to the clinking of golden rings. I will never get tired of this sound. Of course I couldn't pass by a gorgeous Tomb Raider runner. Laura Croft Relic Run is a runner with incredible level dynamics. Every second you are going to dodge, slide, and avoid falling ancient architecture. Shoot at enemies on the way, pick up relics, and fight against bosses. Take your Tomb Raider through jungles and ancient temples. Jump over the traps and overcome obstacles while riding a bike. Complete the story campaign, find ancient treasures, and reveal a horrible secret. And now, let's go forward to the past! Recently, I bumped into Demolition Inc., a funny strategy-like game in which you are going to destroy mankind with the help of an extraterrestrial jerk. In Demolition Inc., you will control a flying saucer with a Martian named Mike. He works for a company which deals with recycling planetary waste. Your task is to crash into as much as you can and kill as many people as possible. Spread blots, slime, set kidnapped cows free, control vehicles distantly, and bring waves to the city. Game physics and overall destructibility is enough to kill time and have fun. Well, it's time to name the game of the week. I am extremely embarrassed as I carry great responsibility, and my authority is on the line, but the game of the week is Danger Dodgers. Please forgive me. Danger Dodgers is a crazy game in which you're going to move a funny character dodging huge meteorites falling from the sky in a random order. All you need to do is to swipe the screen of your device, moving the hero across the playing field, and watch the shades of the coming fall. Help a dinosaur, astronaut, robot, ballet dancer, alien, and other characters avoid destruction in order to set new records. Funny characters, simple gameplay, and beautiful plasticine graphics will bring lots of gaming enjoyment. It's time to have a look at the anticipated games and see what new is waiting for us on Android in the near future. I don't know about you, but I am really waiting for any good fighting games on Android, so the announcement of the port release of a gorgeous game for this genre could not have come at a better time. Maybe you have already heard about it, or maybe even played it. Skullgirls is an incredibly fast fighting game in which players will control furious female warriors in an unusual world. A classic six-button system of controls provides each character with various attacks and special moves. 
Moreover, artificial intelligence will independently master tactics and combos against you, so those who like serious fighting games will get a real present even before the new year starts. Let's hope. And now let's cheer up with a funny trash game. Oh, it's alive! It's alive! It's alive! It's alive! I kept on thinking about where to mention Dropsy. On one hand, it is worthy of being Game of the Week, but it is still at the testing stage. On the other hand, it is worthy of being a top game. We have already had this kind of top game. So this is why Dropsy will become the most high-quality trash game for today. Being a child of the 90s, I am partial to trash, psychedelia, pixel games, clowns, and quests. So Dropsy completely fits my fetish. In this game, you're going to help a clown whose name is Dropsy find friends. But that's not so easy when you're a scary fat clown with only five teeth, and many grown-ups and children are afraid of you. But he could talk to animals. Help a good clown cover the distance and learn his story, revealing the deepest aspects of such themes as love and kind-heartedness. Don't pass by this surprisingly charming weird game. And that's all for today. Click the like button, share the video with friends. Well, you know the deal. Here's our game site, and here's where to subscribe. See ya!